Thank you, Noel. If you're looking for self-improvement or even a new job, did you know a librarian could help? On this National Library Workers' Day, their dedication and expertise is being celebrated. Amanda Lozano has the story. We have a staff of about 55, uh, 25 part-time and roughly 30 full-time. Today is National Library Workers' Day, a day to celebrate all of the hard work, dedication, and expertise of library support staff and librarians. We're giving away free bags to hold all the materials that you check out from us at all of our branches. But library workers do much more than just help you check out a book. There you go. Thank you. We have a number of departments. We have the circulation desk, and then we have a reference department that assists with using online research and databases. And we also have shelvers. We have a whole team in the back. And then there's administration, which is me, and I have two others. And being a part of the staff requires many more qualifications than one may think. You do need to uh, have a bachelor's degree, and then you go on to graduate school. I went to UT, which is accredited. I think there are three or four others in the state that offer that. So it, it's, a, it's a more involved program than many people think. Despite the advancements in technology, library workers are still irreplaceable. Many even compare them to search engines with a heart. We are living in such an information-rich time, how to analyze and evaluate uh, databases and websites, helping them locate material. It's just, it's a very important time in terms of fact-checking and, and all of that. So today, and any day you can, recognize library workers, because they are the most important asset of any library. We're also, you know, a great resource for self-improvement, helping people find jobs, learn a new skill. We're kind of the go-to place for all of those enriching efforts. Amin Rosano, KLSC News.